hello guys welcome in this video today in this video we are going to show you how to divide two numbers in assembly language and how to display a reminder in assembly language so let's start over today video without any further delay uh, first of all in this video i am going to display a message that is uh, enter first number on screen this will ask first number from user and uh, second message for second number enter second number on screen So now here I am going to initialize two variables to store two numbers that we are going to take input from user. So variable one first variable and a variable uh, one as a second variable. So now here I am going to display first message move vdx comma offset and uh, then call write string as we are going to display string of course. So we have to display string and then call read int we are going to take input as an integer and uh, then we are going to store input value in a variable so here i am going to move accumulator register value into variable so now i am going to copy these three lines and uh, going to repeat this for second message and changing variable uh, message one and uh, then call read read it here i have done already and now i am going to move second input value into second variable so we are having two variables value in uh, sorry we are having two values in two variables so now we are going to perform division first of all we need to move edx0 uh, that uh, is necessary to get remainder as we are going to display remainder in our video so that is necessary we have to follow so for the first variable in accumulator register and a second variable value in base register that is ebx now div ebx and then call right end this will display the actual result of division so now we are going to take remainder so as we have uh, uh, stored edx0 that's why because we are going to store remainder in it so now we are going to display it so we will move edx value in accumulator register that is move ex comma edx uh, edx value will be moved in ex and then call right in to display what is in remainder so now debug start debugging let's check our program yes you can see enter first number okay uh, i am going to add 10 and the second number 250 now change numbers again start debugging again and the first number 9 and uh, 2 you can see remainder 1 4 and to separate remainder call crlf for new line so now debug it again start debugging and uh, yes you can see and the first number again 10 uh, 105 and 252 remainder 1 so that was our today video thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon